you had such the weekend. I had the weekend. You had such the weekend. Your your high school reunion. Let me tell you something. Um, it was okay. I went to Fort Hunt High School. Yes. And that school has been closed down for 38 years. Do you know what happened when they had a reunion for the whole school? What? Everybody came. Oh. Everybody came. It's a public school yeah. that has put out like incredible people, like a Pulitzer Prize winning author, uh, a, a design expert, astronaut, senators, blah, blah, what? blah. Yes, they're all there. Those guys, those are legends. I cannot believe that there are so many people there. That was the football coach. Uh, like when you walked was up. The football yes, coach when you coach were there. Coach Granetti, Mr. Dietze was there. I couldn't even call him by their first names. I mean, you know, that how was you your do teacher, that. Mr. Mr. Dietze, he was the athletic director. I was. Uh, and there's my sister and some, look what's look, happening. they were dressed in cheerleader costumes. Oh, my costumes. God, it was like old home. Like I could still spin it. You know that. Yes. Anyway, it was so <laughs> fun. And at the end, I was telling a story about how I was, I was a late bloomer in high school and a late bloomer in life and all the best things in my life happened after 50. And I talked about how I had my girls after 50. And I brought just hope. My uh, Haley was with my mom yeah. enjoying some grandma time. And I said something. I said, you know, one of the best calls I ever got in my life was when the, the phone rang and it was the adoption agency. And I, I didn't know what a, what a birth felt like. I've never given birth to a child. But when you get a phone call and you, and you listen, and I said, hello, and the woman on the other end, the adoption agency said, she's here. And I thought, she's here. Oof. And so when <laughs> I was at my reunion and I said to, and to Hope, and she's here. And little Hope came buzzing up on the stage, not afraid of anything, wearing my old high school cheerleading <laughs> uniform. Anyway, it was really, it was a fun, fun weekend. I got to see old friends. And you know it was what's just, so amazing so about cool. that is what? that I feel like those reunions yeah. sort of automatically make you take stock of where you've come yes. from and then where you are. Yes. And I bet, you know, in high school, those were your dreams, right? Yes. Like part of it was yes. this, part of it was that. Yes. Having a, a babe. Yes. And there you are on the stage. With the babe. Both of those oh, things. It was so, it was like one of those kind of pinch me amazing moments and I think to see so many people like to see old friends it was just so you know how you're looking at someone's name tag and you're like oh my god you know it was like Michelle Gayhart yes. you know when you just look at someone's tag and you just can't believe that they're standing in front of you but anyway oh. it was beautiful and I want to say thank you to all the Fort Hunt Federals let's go oh I love it Girl. I love it okay oh, so and they asked about you a thousand times you're very popular I wish I could have gone bill. with you oh, I would have just wanted you. to hook you up with all the boys though how's you know Jenna I mean? how's Jenna <laughs> I'm like Jenna's good let's be get back to me by okay? the way I'm the type of person that looks at your Instagrams yeah. it's like <laughs> I'm like now who is that man who well there was one of the men oh that Mike Novogratz. Yeah, yeah. He was another. Yeah. He's ma Unfortunately, it seems that he's married um, upon Google search. <laughs> but we need like a Mike Rolograph for Nova, you. <laughs> Novogratz. That's a legendary family at Fort Hunt.